Right, my last 15k run before Sunday, absolutely terrified. Um, I was up at half past six this morning. Um, well, that's it, I've learned a lot over the past six weeks. I know it's been absolute madness thinking I can run a marathon uh, after only six weeks training, but you know, it's been a learning curve. I've learned that my bazookas will never defy gravity and um, my feet were actually made for, for being in high heels on the dance floor, not trainers pounding the pavements, but there you go. Um, we all need a bit of madness in our lives and a lot of love and faith. Oh, by the way, I won't be wearing this hat on Sunday. They really won't um, appreciate that in Barcelona, will they? Anyway, thank you. Well, thank you, just thank you. Because, um, you know, let's see what happens. I am really scared, but I'm also sort of excited. I'm going to be seeing my mate Caroline there. And uh, she's awesome and she'll be doing it in um, record time. And then she'll come back and help me over. But, I, I mean, I don't know whether I get make it to the finishing line or not. It's all about the journey, not the... What's that saying? It's all about the journey, not the destination. Um, I'm also going to have to... I'm not allowed, apparently, that I'm not allowed to wear these. And, um, you know, I always... I mean, I always like to break, break the rules, but I'm going to conform and just um, stick to the jukebox in my head. And, um, and we'll see what happens. I've never run a marathon. Well, why would I have run a marathon before? I mean, that's the, the whole thought is quite ridiculous, really. But um, there you go. I'm going to try and, try and do it on Sunday and, um, and just see what happens. It's in, that, it's in the hands of him upstairs now, really. Love and faith.